I does a community watch today in the city of Redondo Beach doing the First Amendment audit. United States Post Office, Redondo Beach, California. I'm out here by myself today. We uh, finished up that house that we were doing with laminate, so uh, we got a day or two off before we start working again on the next job, so. Here's the main entrance to the post office. Hours. They have a self service uh, kiosk here. Really clean, really nice. Very nice pictures. Here we have the flag. So I'm going to go around to the back. See what they say, they were already looking at me weird, so. Um. So here we are, back gate. You can see she's back in the driveway. We'll get her license plate, make sure we uh so she gets for stopping. to a car wash here and then you got the AEG plant I believe back there. Have a good day. What's going on? Just doing a little story. What? Just doing a little story. What story? A story. About what? Uh, above the post office. Oh, for what? Easy reader or time? Uh, see who picks it up. Uh, just getting some shots. Sometimes they just get the, the shots. Like sometimes it's just for Redondo Beach. It's for, it could be for a thousand different things. They pick them up. Yeah. Good luck. yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Be safe. Okay. Nice guy. I'm sure uh, that lady's not done, so there she is.
Dr. Vader, I, I can't talk right now. I didn't ask for help. See, so because they're merely post office workers, they think they could take my picture, but they think I can't take yes, their picture. Uh, we the Redondo Beach post office. We have a suspicious guy right here. He's coming in, um, take pictures of um, our, our facility, and we ask him to leave, he won't. And yeah, he continues to stand here and have to try to video with um, people, um, post office. Um, I'm not sure what he wants, but um, he is uh, uh, Good. Yes, Gene. How about five five or something? Uh, he is right. Tell him you're back game. You're going to learn about the law today. Listen to these liars. I'm disruptive. I've never approached anybody or said anything to anybody. They approach me, but I'm disruptive. This is the snitch culture in America. That's a slow, creepy walk of shame. It's funny stuff, guys. I haven't been rude to them. I know they're just postal employees. I know a lot of you guys were bitching about, oh, they don't know. So there, I'll let them show their stupidity all on their own.
Oh, how you doing? Good. Can I ask why you're uh, filming over here? You may ask, but I don't want you talking. Thank you. Do you have any ID I could take a look at? No, yeah, I have to commit a crime. You can't just pull up and ask people's IDs. You know that's not the law. I mean, I what's, your name, what's your name, badge number? S. Martin? Officer Martin, and I'm filming you as well. All right, I'm, I'm doing a uh, protected act, sir. Okay. And so I, I'd like to be left alone so I can finish my narrating. Thank well, you. I'm actually, you're on a public street or a public sidewalk, so am I. I have, I have a reason uh, to talk to you and ask you questions. Yeah, you don't have to answer my questions. Thank you. You have a good day, sir. You're dismissed. I'm going to walk behind you so I can come over here. Okay. Can you explain to him about the law so he can stop coming out and threatening me? Thank you. Are you a resident of Redondo Beach? I don't answer personal questions, sir. Thank you. Okay. Especially to men with guns. I don't know you. Do you, uh, have, are you a former employee of a uh, post no, office? No, uh, you yeah, have a good day, sir. Do you have a problem with one of the employees over here? You yeah, have a good day, sir. I'm having a wonderful day, sir. Me too, sir. You're making it even more wonderful because now you're giving me a good video. Okay. Are you on parole or probation? Are you, sir? Have you have you violated anybody's rights? I'm not violating your rights, sir. I'm, just no, I'm asking, asking you. I'm asking you. Are you are you under investigation, internal affairs for uh, beating anybody up, shooting anybody? See how it feels. Don't feel good when somebody asks you that no, question. I'm not out. under investigation. Are for you anything. sure? I'm positive. What's your badge number? 1224. 1224. We'll look into that. He refuses to answer questions. Refuses to identify himself. Okay. Yeah, you guys can all, you guys are all dismissed. There's probably a real crime in Redondo Beach you guys should be taking care of. Do you know why he's harassing the post office? I'm not harassing nobody, I'm videotaping, sir. You got anything else to do? Well, do you have anything else to do? You don't, you don't, you don't like the First Amendment? It offends you or what? No, you can do whatever you want, man. So then leave me alone. Go, go bother well, a people. called, so we had to come. Yeah, I already explained to him what I was doing, so. Huh? I already explained to him what I was doing. Okay. I don't answer personal questions. Dude, I try to talk to him. What's in the property, so that's all. I can go on the property. No, yes, I'll challenge you. I'll challenge you. That's fine. I'll challenge you. I'll go on the property right now. Over there in the front. Watch. They don't want you in the it doesn't matter. I, they can't kick me out. It's a DHS memo that was sent 2010 that I'm allowed to do exactly what I was doing on federal property, Fred yeah. military installations. So I, I'll challenge. No, I'll challenge you. I'll challenge you though. Okay. Hey, that's not. I'm going on their property over here where I'm allowed to be. You don't give me that. Look, you can't. That's stupid for you to tell me that because I'm nowhere near their line. Then let's challenge the law. Go ahead and do it. No, no, no. Challenge the law by doing something legal and you being the criminal, not me. You understand that I never planned, right? You understand that I never planned to go over there, right? You were on there. You were over there. Where? You were on this portion of the property and you were not allowed there. Oh, are you sure? Are you sure about that? Positive. I was right here. I was in here. Do you have evidence? I challenge you on that. I call you a bullshitter. Show me evidence because I have everything here. Listen, I'm no, no, you listen, buddy. You listen. You work for me. You listen. This is the only profession where you can treat the people like shit that you work for and you know, there's no consequences. Well, guess what? Today, you ain't doing shit and I'm going to do and do whatever I want because I'm free. Have your, have That's it. right. So you're dismissed. Suck it easy. I was on their property. Yeah, right. The whole basis of what I do is being staying legal, man. Yeah. I've been raising my family my whole life, oh, that's bro. That's great. That's yeah. good. At least yeah. you're a family man. So why aren't you home with them right now? Just uh, um, because I'm ordering some floor and I, decided, I saw the post office, so I, so I had this paperwork, so I decided to do a story. That's great. Yeah. That's good. It's called freedom, man. That's, uh, I love it. Part actually, you don't. Part actually, you don't. Actually you, guys, actually, you guys don't, bro. You guys would love to hand me up and fucking throw me on the hood and all that shit, you know. I can tell you by the way you guys pulled up, but you gotta tuck your tail and go home, bro. The law puts you in check and myself too. So. Would you like to see the paper I'm doing the story on? If you wanna talk, I could talk to you. If you come over here, I don't wanna step on your property.
It's fine. They're here. I'm, I don't mean no harm or nothing. I was just doing a story on the, there was a, a, set, a memo sent in 2010 that gives us the right to record all federal uh, complexes, buildings, military, anything. But the, the, the point is, as long as we're, we're in a public place, we're allowed to be, sir. That's so why. What was the point you're trying to? Uh, we just record uh, uh, stories of, of uh, public interest, and then somebody might pick them up. Just, I, I'm doing a story on this memo itself, and I, I know this is a federal installation, as all post offices are. So that's all I was doing the story on. And I did talk to one of your drivers, and I, I explained to him he had no problems. That's all I was doing. And there's, you can look it up on the, if you just put a uh, declassified memo for uh, federal installations, and it just tells them also that they can't come and harass me as long as I stay on the sidewalk. So that, that's all I was doing. I just needed a shot of a truck going in or out. That's all. You have, a, you have a good one too, stay safe. I might have been an asshole, but I do mean stay safe, I do mean that. There they go. And here's the other one. 